Can you tell us a little bit about this museum and the library? Sure. The Wilson Library houses five different special collections. The uh, North Carolina Collection Gallery is the exhibit component for the North Carolina Collection, which focuses mainly on the history and the objects, uh, the material goods for North Carolina history. Uh, can you speak about Sir Walter Raleigh and about what this exhibit means a little bit? Absolutely. So Sir Walter Raleigh was one of the higher courtiers of uh, Queen Elizabeth's court back in England. He was very um, famous for a lot of different things. He was a military uh, commander, he was an explorer, he was an adventurer, he was an author, a poet, uh, advisor to the Queen. And one of the things that really uh, cements in a North Carolina history is that he paid for three expeditions to come to the New World. He was one of the first to really attempt the colonization of North Carolina. We're looking at life about 30 years before Jamestown. So what we have here in the North Carolina Collection Gallery is the Sir Walter Raleigh rooms. These rooms feature period furnishing, furnishings from Sir Walter Raleigh's time. Although he never used any of these items, uh, he definitely would have felt very comfortable in this space. Um, because the items are so old, it's hard to really have visitors interact with our exhibit. Um, even though you come in and you stand in the environment of Sir Walter Raleigh to really immerse yourself and discover the way they would have used these items helps our visitors really understand that history. supported by the carved bulbous supports, often looking like cups. Highly decorative court cupboards are a symbol of wealth. We display our silver cups and statues on the, their shelves. How does this AR tour contribute to the display experience? Well, we are hoping that visitors, when they come into this space, they are out of their element because it is such an old space. Even the panel dates from the late 1500s. And with such old items, it's uh, important to really understand where we are now and where we came from. It's hard to really engage and experience these pieces without being able to touch or to feel them. So with this AR experience, we're hoping that visitors can really engage with the items, see how these items were used, what was displayed on them, and really give it a sense of life to a room that might otherwise appear lifeless.